Hello, my name is Prashant. I'm a technical marketing engineer in the Cisco SD-WAN product team. This video demonstrates some of the UX Dorado features in the SD-WAN release 20.8.17.8. Site topology visualization is auto-generated site topology built from the configuration groups. It shows all the devices that are connected to the selected site. To reach the site topology page, click on the site ID in the Manage. The 20.8.17.8 release is the phase one of this feature. At the top, the VPN0, that is the transport interfaces, are shown with details of the interface name, IP address, and color. For the device, the device model and the system IP is shown. At the bottom, the service VPN's information is shown. VPN ID, VPN name, protocol, and interface name. Since there can be several service VPNs, only three of them are shown and the rest can be viewed by clicking on the More button. This will show a sidebar with details of all the service VPNs in a tabular format. At the bottom right corner, there are topology interaction icons for full screen mode, zoom in, and zoom out. The UX Tour Auto Workflows library consists of several workflows which are basically a guided series of steps to perform a certain task. The Rapid Site Configuration Group workflow is one such workflow. This helps you to create a simplified single router branch configuration group. Provide a name and description for the configuration group. The workflow has smart defaults for several configuration. Create a basic feature profile or choose from existing ones. Next, create the WAN and LAN feature profiles or choose from existing ones. Review the configuration. Next, we can continue to provision the configuration group to devices using the provisioning workflow, or we can just create the configuration group and end the workflow here. Provisioning can be done later. The What's Next section here shows a series of actions that are meaningful next steps. One of them is associating some devices to the newly created configuration group. Choose the devices to associate. Review and save. Next, provision the devices with the configuration group. Choose the devices. Provide the device specific configuration. Review. A CLI preview is also available. Finally, deploy the configuration. The deployment status can be viewed. Two new UX 2.0 dashboards that were introduced in the SD-WAN release 20.7 are the Devices dashboard and the Tunnels dashboard. Clicking on the Devices fill takes you to the Devices dashboard. The columns to view can be selected as required.
There are also tabs for viewing co-location clusters, certificates, and licensing information. A search bar is also available to filter based on users' needs. Clicking on the tunnel spill takes you to the tunnels dashboard. There is also a tab for viewing SIG tunnels information. Columns to view can be selected as required. A search bar is also available to filter based on users' needs. Thank you for watching.